to be real, sometimes it's not easy to maintain the highest vibrations possible. A lot of outside external factors happen in life that knock us down or just cause us to feel overwhelmed, stress, be in a state of depression and just like complete sadness. And that's okay. It's normal. This is like life. It's, we're having a human experience here. But there are certain things you have to incorporate into your life to try to function as high as vibration as possible. So if you can like meditate in the mornings, do some journaling, if you like to listen to affirmation, anything that's going to instill a sense of positivity into your mindset at the beginning of the day and help raise your like levels of vibrations at the start is going to be a good starting point to any day some people like to work out go for a run just get out that stagnant energy that's stuck inside your body because as much as you're like journaling and meditating sometimes the energy is just stuck within you you have to have an outlet for it to be released in a healthy way um drinking a lot of water and the diet that you have is so important as well eliminating all the sugary foods like consuming more fruits and vegetables your body's your temple like feed it the necessary nutrients in order for it to be substantial in order for you to live the life that you want to live as well as kind of like trash tv things that don't provide value to you ends up wasting your time when you could be doing things that you love or that's going to feed into goals or dreams that you do have as well as your subconscious is always listening and is always aware. So you feeding it these things that are so low vibrational, it's not going to help. It's like contradictory to the life that you need to be living or that you want to live. So I would say like start off like that. And I'm not saying it's like a one, two, three process, especially if you're in a rut right now. It takes work and it takes time and it has to become a routine. For me, like being Cali, like the first month I was off for like one, like the whole month. I kept having up and down states every other day. And I had to be really consistent with going back into my routine in this new place and like trying to find a sense of self within all these changes that were around me and like going with the flow of them. So it was just a lot to go through. So I'm not even talking as if it's easy. I'm talking because I experienced it. I lived it multiple times. And it just it's always a sense of falling off the horse and getting back on. But these are like necessary steps in order for you to be in that high positive vibration in order to gain all the miracles and blessings that are there for you. Because you have to be in alignment to it. And you can't be in a lack mindset and ex expect abundance. You can't be consuming low vibrational things and expect the utmost of highest value stuff to be rewarded or brought to your life. It doesn't work that way. You have to be what you want to attract. You have to become the lifestyle that you want to be in. And you have to actually take conscious efforts to chase your dreams and become the best version of yourself possible so i wish you the best of luck we are all in this together and just do what you gotta do period bye